is slightly overcast and cool in the nation's capital. A sellout crowd at RFK Stadium as the New York Giants and the Washington Redskins meet for the second time this year. Second down and six. And Parat has Asher, the tight end, and he won't get the first down. He'll be stopped about a yard short and good defense by Corey Miller to prevent the first down. Third down and one. Here's Allen. And Terry Allen, a second effort, is enough for a first down. The Giants had hit Allen at the line of scrimmage, and he gets the first down to the 44. You know, you talk to any fans in this league right now, and say, name me the three hottest backs. Terry Allen's name comes up right away. Michael Westbrook, who has had knee problems, playing today is in as a third wide receiver. Here is a cornerback blitz, but Farrakh gets it off to Ellard, and a first down inside the 35-yard line. Wait, I'm gonna tell you something, Dick. Just what we just talked about, in and out of his breaks, now, I want you to watch. They come with a blitz. Watch them get in and then right back out. There's no stick. There's no stop. Second down and eight. And on a reverse, double reverse, here is Leslie Shepard. And he is open down the sideline and gets inside the 10 and the 5 and still on his feet and knocked out of bounds at about the 2. You see who sprung him? Gus Ferrat. Running the whole offense when he has to get a block to take somebody out. Here comes the reverse. Now, here's the first thing, okay? Start one way, come back. Now, here comes back the other way. Now, watch for Rod. Hey, right there. He got that block, which allowed Shepard to get down to the end. I want you to watch Rod. Now, he's got to get Bratsky down. See this right here? He takes him down, and now you get off to the race. All week long, they were making a big deal about the, the reverses. First and goal at the two-yard line, and this crowd on its feet. An impressive first drive, and Terry Allen walks in for the touchdown. You won't get a drive executed any better than that. Allen puts the Redskins in front, or called better. I mean, you got to go right to the sideline and pat Norb Turner right on the back because that was very well called. Watch Trey Johnson right inside. Nice job by Galbraith right here. Trey Johnson, you just blow a hole in that right side, and boy, that's six points very easily. Watch Galbraith stay on Bradsky, and then here comes Trey Johnson. So he gets with him and just blows him right out. You saw how many sacks? 15, more than half of the sacks of Dave Brown have come on third down. We've got a third and eight. And Brown slipped, and he goes down again, and that was Dexter Nottage. And that's on Dave Brown. I'm going to tell you something. Chris Callaway was wide open to the middle of the field. Nothing there. Brown held it a little too long. So third down and eight. Farad's pass up the middle. Caught by Leslie Shepard with a fine catch on a bullet throw and a first down into Giant territory. And if you can pass protect and you have Gus Farad, who's learning your offense, you can really take advantage of it. See how he steps and throws? Nobody even sniffed him. And the ball's right in the middle of that defense. Again, they want to take advantage of the young safeties back there, particularly Ellsworth, and he got right to the middle of the field. Third and five from the 38. Good protection for Barack, and the pass is intercepted by Percy Ellsworth. And the rookie from the University of Virginia snuffs out a redskin threat and brings it down to the 31 of the skins. Dossie in a third wide receiver, third and three, and Brown goes down. And what this does is put in peril the Giants' field goal range. Dexter Nottage making the play. You have to fight to get open. And right now, look, nobody's there. Dossie up top on Turner, and then inside Carter. And then Harvey makes him step up inside. And then Nottage is right there to take it away. First down on the 36. Play action. And Farrakh with time completes the pass to Henry Ellard. And Ellard with a first down into Giant territory. A gain of 16 yards. The picture is worth a thousand words. Just watch. And there's nobody near. I mean, he could get back there and read anything he wants. Nobody even close to him. When you have that much time, you can run a crossing route. Crossing routes are the toughest things to defend. Redskins with a 65 to minus two edge in passing. First down, Ellard looking right, going left, and he completes another pass to Henry Ellard. Ellard with eight catches and 152 yards last week, looking like he wants to top that in the first but, quarter. And this one's on Farrakh. Watch where he looks first. Over there, all right, safety move over. I mean, you give it a pump, that's going to clear things for Henry Ellard right down the slot. 
because of this little pump. See this right there? The safety moves inside Wooten. 20 yard pickup for Ellard, who has three catches for 58 yards. And Terry Allen finds an opening in Ellard. Or Allen gets to about the 20 yard line and a big gain on first down of about eight yards. Tito Wooten making the stop. And this first quarter has been a total domination by the Redskins, despite the fact that the one turnover has been committed by Washington. Second and two. Terry Allen, first down, Redskins, and out of bounds. Third down and ten, and a screen to Brian Mitchell. Good blocking for Mitchell. He's at the five and down to about the two. Okay. Armstead, ninth play of the drive, first and goal at the one. And Terry Allen is in for his second touchdown. Well, Allen had a string of touchdowns in 10 straight games broken last week against New England. He has come back before the home fans and have scored two touchdowns here to give the Redskins a 13 to nothing lead. Third down and two on their 30. And here is Wheatley, and he stopped at the 30. Might have lost a half a yard on the play. Sean Gilbert's the guy who got through. Leslie Shepard in motion to the right. Deep drop by Farad and a screen pass to Mark Logan. Logan getting away from a couple of defenders and a first down. And here's another guy you want to talk about, a reason why the Redskins have done so well is Mark Logan. Every season, you go in and you say, okay, we're going to have this guy, and hopefully he does okay. And, you know, we know what we got in this game. And you got Mark Logan. And you say, okay, we know what he got. He's going to be he's going to be solid all the time in the running game, and he catched the ball okay. But, boy, he's really stepped his game up. Redskins have gained six yards a play. That'll get it done any game. Third down and ten. Barat completes to Henry Ellard, who's out of bounds. Ellard's fourth catch of the game, and a gain of 15 yards, and a first down. Tito Wooten was defending on the play, but Ellard having another big game for the Redskins. Ball in midfield for the Redskins, who lead 14 to nothing. Ellard faking, going to Ellard, wide open, and Henry Ellard inside the five-yard line, going against Seahorn. That's the guy, as Matt mentioned, the Redskins wanted to go against and a well, gain of 48. He gave him a double move. He's gonna watch him. He's gonna come, bend it outside, and then get right down. See, there was the pump. Did you see that little pump? And Seahorn made the mistake of turning around and looking, and he bit. All this is set up. There was the bump outside. Now there's the pump. And that's when Seahorn looked and bit, and that allowed Henry Ellard to get to the top side and set up this. With four minutes remaining in the first half, Terry Allen is over for his third touchdown in the first half. And tempers flaring in the middle of that huddle, in that scrimmage. And the Giants have to be feeling some of that frustration as the Redskins dominating the Giants' defense. Henry Ellard already with five catches for 119 yards, coming off a 152-yard game last week. Big catches by Henry Ellard, and it is 21 to nothing. Allen with three touchdowns to the hang off by Blandon. And it'll be Tyrone Wheatley on the return. Wheatley finding some running room. And a fine return by Wheatley. Beyond the 45-yard line, that is a 35-yard return. Here comes pressure on Brown, and he has an open receiver, Thomas Lewis. Brown is 4 of 7 for 41 yards. That's not much. Second down and 10, and the pass off the hands. It's intercepted, Darrell Green with a race. With one man, and that's Brown to beat. He won't get him. Darrell Green will score. No flags. Sixty-eight yards on the return, and only the second time in Daryl Green's career that he has intercepted a pass against the New York Times. That's the one's not on Dave Brown. That ball came flopping out. Green picked it off. He had one against Phil Sims. And now he has one 
against Dave Brown. I got news for you. If Tony Dorsett didn't run away from him, Dave Brown, <laughs> Dave Brown wasn't going to catch him. A good observation. That pass was intended for Lewis, and it was deflected off of him into the hands of Darrell Green, who continues to play sensational football at the age of 36. Scott Blanton's kick is good, and the Redskins have a four-touchdown lead over the Giants. It's 28 to nothing. And that ball's got to be caught. I mean, Darrell Green slipped, came up, the ball's there, and you're not going to catch this guy. I mean, you got to hope that that sideline right there, it gets a little wider. Maybe the sideline trips him because as a, as a quarterback, he wasn't going to get there. The thing that amazes me about Darrell Green, see, that, that should be a completion. Darrell Green is almost too good to believe. Darrell Green has the Darrell Green Youth Foundation. He's very active in the community. He's a stand-up guy. He's a leader. He has a lot of respect both on and off the field. I've always called him do good. Yes, ODG. Every time we come to practice on Friday, you say, do good? What's going on? And he's and always around where we are with the defensive back. And he always has a big smile on his face. Brown's pass is caught by Thomas Lewis, and he gets the Giants out of trouble. Play action. Brown has time, and his pass caught by Lewis. And he's got a first down inside the Redskin 45. Third and 10. And the quick pass to Callaway. And he holds on to it. Good catch by Callaway. Darrell Morrison put the hit on. And Callaway makes the reception. The Giants have made some very tough catches today. First down on the 31 of the Redskins. Dave Brown with a short drop going deep for Lewis. And Lewis has it. Touchdown. That's Giants. a great play by Lewis. Dow Green turned around right at the end, and Lewis gets six. Third and ten. Redskins impress a five of seven on third downs today. Converted. Farad. Has tip intended for Westbrook, and it was Felipe Sparks who battled Westbrook, who has not caught a pass returning after being hurt in the first giant Redskin game. Second down and four. Play fake. Rolling out, and there is Charles Wade wide open out of the backfield, and Wade gives the Giants a first down, a gain of 19, right about the 30-yard line. Carter and Richard defends. Brown underneath has Callaway touchdown. 13 yards to Chris Callaway, and the Giants have cut a 28-0 deficit in half. If the extra point is good. And they've also protected Dave Brown on two successive series, and they've come up with two touchdowns. Watch up inside. They, they're not going to go with the blitz. They're going to go regular format. Nice step up. See the field. Ball comes out. Callaway underneath. Crossing receiver again. They caught him in the zone. Stevens runs by, and it's six quick. Look at how the Giants have controlled the ball control part of this game in the second half. A wide margin for the Giants. First down. And Brown's pass is caught by Howard Cross, and he's close to midfield and out of bounds after a gain of 14. First down Giants with Patton and Richard defending. A lot of time to throw the football again. Second and seven in Redskin territory. Pressure on Brown, and he's got Charles Way. And there it was. And Way is close to the first down. We may need a measurement on the 40. Ken Harvey defending yeah. on the play. But they came with the blitz. Galloway slipped, reversing his motion. Brown has time, and he's got Lewis. Lewis fumbles. And let's see if the Redskins have recovered. Oh, the whistle will come in, and the whistle had blown. It is still Giants' ball. Ooh, that's a, that's a quick one. So the Giants maintain possession, second down and ten. Brown's pass caught by Lewis. This time he holds on to it, and a first down inside the Redskins 25-yard line. Rod Stevens on the tackle. That was a 15-yard gain, and down is Rod Stevens, the middle linebacker. Brown has Callaway. Callaway, and a flag is down late as Callaway is tackled at the four-yard line by Darrell Morrison. And the penalty may be against the Redskins. That's the preliminary call. And holding against Washington will give the Giants a first down. And 
Wheatley gets to the one. Tyrone Wheatley, and not only has that offensive line done a great job of protecting Dave Brown, Matt, they are but coming up the some holes as well. Yes, they are. 14th play of this drive, second and goal at the one. And here is Wheatley, and he's in for the touchdown. Tyrone Wheatley scores, and this second half has been a giant half, and they can come within seven points if Daloiso converts the extra point. A shocked crowd here at RFK Stadium. Again, just coming right off, watch Lance, Ron Stone pulling outside. A nice block right there, and just took Daryl Morrison out, and that was Charles Way. Third down and six on the 29, following the timeout. Parat's pass. Oh, big third Perot down. Makes a big catch. What a big catch by, by Asher. Asher had dropped a couple and uh, did not get a few earlier because of... A poor throw and a 14-yard pass and a first down. This is just a monster catch by Asher. That ball is outside. You have to stretch, and that's what you got. I mean, you got to come down at the balls where it had to be. Barat off his back foot throws it away. No one downfield, and a late flag is thrown. Illegal contact. Defense, number 37, five yards. Automatic first That's down. Jesse Campbell and the Redskins pick up another first down as a result. So following the penalty, first and five in giant territory for the Redskins. And here is Allen. He's got a first down inside the 40. A second and eight at the 37. Barat gives to Terry Allen. Going left. Allen with a good game. Pushed out of bounds and a first down for James, the Redskins. James Jenkins, the tight end. Char for Donish on the left side. They enabled them to get to that corner, and Terry Allen turned it. You watch him right down the bottom. There's James Jenkins. He's working inside, and then because he holds up 94, Cedric Jones, that allows Terry Allen to turn that corner. Third and 17. Farad <laughs> underneath, and Brian Mitchell is hit at the 28-yard line, and that's fourth down. Jesse Armstead making the play, and Blanton will come on to try to give the Redskins a 10-point lead. And Blanton's kick is long enough, and the kick is good. A big three-pointer for Blanton and the Redskins, who now move in front 31-21. to That's a big kick. Giants have only one timeout left and need two scores. Again, you know, as you look at this kick, you got to think back to the penalty that they called on Jesse Campbell that enabled him to get that big first down on Asher, and I, I thought it was a non-call. And as Norm Turner watches the ball sail through the uprights, Redskins trying to escape a furious second-half rally. Watch Norm Turner... He went from wrinkles to no wrinkles in one kick. <laughs> Blanton hit that thing square right down the middle. First down for the Giants on the 30. They need two scores in a short period of time. And here is Callaway, first down of the 45. And the Giants only one timeout remaining. They try to play fake, and the pass to Callaway, complete. Out of bounds, stops the clock at the 43. Tom Carter defended. First down at the 43 of the Redskins. Brown's pass caught by Howard Cross. The tight end gets inside the 25 for a gain of 19. And we're down to the two-minute warning. Brown's going for it here, and Callaway. He had him, too. And focus. And the pass is caught by Cross, and he dropped it. Boy, it was, looked like it was tipped inside. Maybe Marcus Patton got a hand up or... Two down territory, third, third and ten at the 24. Giants have two downs to move it. Here comes pressure on Brown. Steps up, throws, and overthrows Lewis. And nice. coverage again by Turner, who's replaced Daryl Green. He's done a good job. As yes, a he has. And this will be a 41-yard attempt for Brad Deluiso, who's attempted only one from this distance and has missed it this year. Horan, the punter, will hold, and the kick is up, and it is no good. It is off to the right, and Deluiso misses a field goal. 
And the Redskins keep their 10-point lead. And that should spell the end of the Giants' opportunity in this game. And the Washington Redskins, who have dominated in the second half today, saw the opposition take them to task in the second half, but held on to win. Final score, the Washington Redskins 31 and the New York Giants 21. Gus Farratt leads another win, 6-1 and one on the year. And the rough part of the schedule is coming up. But who will turn away 6-1 and one at this stage of the race?